Hi everyone, it's Zen Mommy with Bye Mommy Manual, and today we are joined by mommy expert Debbie Hip, and she is has over a decade of experience in placement of both sitters and nannies. She works for a premier placement agency here in St. Louis called TLC for Kids, and was instrumental in the founding of SignTheBestNanny.com, which is a placement agency that's nationwide. Mm -hmm. So welcome. Thank, Thank you. Thank you. Happy to be here. So today I wanted to ask you to speak to the new moms out there who, or expectant moms, who are getting ready and getting organized for when that baby's coming home. Yeah. And I know I've got two friends who just had newborns, and I had the, the talk last night with both of them. They're about one month in, yeah. and yeah. they're really getting, they're feeling the strains. They're feeling it at home, on their marriage. Personally, they're just tired. Mm -hmm. You know, what can you tell those new moms out there about getting the support sure. they need? Well, I would tell any new mom that you need to set up yourself a support system. You need to take care of yourself and make sure that you're feeling healthy and strong. And do that however you need to. If that means hiring someone, if that means calling over friends, but you need to make sure that you take care of yourself first. And you can do that in a number of ways. And it's not bad to ask for help. Mm -hmm. It is not bad to ask for help. And you need to get that so that you can be strong for your children. Great. What type of things would a, a, a new mom be able to ask of, like a sitter or a nanny yeah. with a newborn at home? When you have a newborn at home, there's a couple different routes you can go. You can hire a sitter or a nanny, or you can hire a doula. And a doula is someone who is specifically trained to work with newborns and newborn moms. So they're there to help recognize the signs of that a mom is going to need help. They're a little bit more versatile in doing more household help if you need that, or they can take care of the baby for you. But there's someone who is there to help you. Most of the time, doulas have mother experience, and so they kind of have that instinct to know to when to pitch in and when, and when to back out a little bit. If you want to hire a doula, you can go to an uh, organization called the International Nanny Association, and their website is www.nanny.org, and they can help you find a doula in your area. If you don't feel, feel like you need the extra support of a doula, but you just need somebody to help you out around the house, then you can hire a nanny or sitter. But when you're doing that, Make sure that you give them, again, a detailed job description so that you know what you're looking for, that your position is going to be a little bit different because it's going to be either caring for a newborn or helping you around the house so that you can spend time with your newborn. Wonderful. Thank you so much, Debbie. Thank you. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.